right, so straight outside the box, I can see said this damage, it's torn. I hope that's all the damage there is to this box and that nothing else inside is damaged so um, so as we open the box we see the 12 by 12 light grip cricket mat and this is the unboxing of my Cricut Explore Air 2 next up we have um, the welcome package guys um, let me see how best I can do this give me a few let me draw for the ring light Alright guys, so this is the unboxing of my Cricut Explore Air 2 Daybreak. So this box came inside this Lowe's box. So it's a box in a box kind of situation. And this was on top of here. Hold on guys, this one like my baby I wake up. Alright guys, so he's still asleep, so open the box, you have a 12 by 12 light grip cricket mat, we're gonna go source that here, I will sit somewhere, next up we have our welcome package. Welcome, let's get started. Um, the Cricut Explore 2 welcome book, and uh, these are some sample paper, more like cardstock. They are what they are. Look here. Look at this. Look at this. A pouch with some silica gel that not necessary. You have the cricket. The cricket pen. You have the power cable. And the USB adapter cable to connect your machine to your laptop. So I'm going to set this up on the table guys and then register and we go for a test cut together. So give me a few. actually a bag a, a, a foam bag <laughs> oh my god look at my baby look at that <laughs> yes that makes high time <laughs> alright guys so I hope you are all able to see my screen from here so i'll be setting up my explore air tool
let's see what this says hmm. make sure you've cleared 10 inches of space behind the cricket and then I'm gonna do all that already do all that already all right what else down there for read please wait guys so it's connected via USB machine registration successful that was quick your cricket X4 family is now set up and registered to your cricket account let's get Started. But me no want to clip none of them something there. I want to clip my own. If you skip the test cut, you can always access this image from canvas. Okay. So. Cricket access, it's legit going to force me to take this. Alright. <coughs> Start your free 30 day trial now. No. Mm. Hold on, guys. I think I'm going to do the test cut. Just give me a few. I want to print something that I can actually press on Caden's shirt myself so this is my test box i'm going to i'm going to calibrate the machine before i print the test and this 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 print that i'm making i'm going to shirt for you so <laughs> 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 So my cut is complete and I'm going to take this off the mat and then slice it and weave it out. But first, let me cover up the mat. So I'm not sure if y'all are seeing this but I'm going to slip right here and then go ahead and weed out. And yes, I have a paper trimmer that I could use. So this can go another cut. And I'm going to weed this off camera and then come back guys. Alright guys, so I'm covering a lot of stuff in this little mini video. I'm going to calibrate my machine for print and cut. Select my 
my printer. It's the HP Desjet 2540 series, and that's correct. Let me see what else comes up. Yeah. And then we're going to select print. But first, let me get the printer on. <laughs> Up. All right, print again. And the sheet is gonna come out down below, and then I'm going to have to align the paper on the mat insert it in the machine and go ahead with the steps that follows Ooh. this is what the collaboration sheet looks like oh jesus it's printing the second one so you have from one through to 21 and from a down to you that's it. Give me a second, guys. Stand up. Don't move. You're standing on the stuff that I give to you, Kim. Be careful. Be careful. I don't want you touching. Come this side. Come this side. Yeah. Don't you dare. You're a crybaby? Leave leave the mat. Okay then. Could you leave the mat? Okay then. I know it sticks. Don't put your hand there. This is where we are working with right now, guys. So, it's going around the lines. Then it's going to do its cut. And have me assess the cut. So it's going to cut the box, the, 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 the square in the middle. So it didn't touch the black line at all. So we are going to have to do a basic cut. And then go again. Trying to get the calibration right. So this looks like it's number 8 for me. Oh Jesus. So my perfect line at the top. Looks like number eight. Good thing it print twice. So this is going to be number eight at the top and F on the right hand side. So at the top choose one, it's number eight. Okay, then stop that. Stop it.
And at the bottom, it's G. We're going to hit continue. Basic calibration complete. And now it's time to unload. I don't need a basic calibration, so I'm going to calibrate this again. And of course, it put a few scratches in my mat. But hey, okay. all right, guys. So this is my machine and my little mini home office. No kidding, in a nutshell. So. Um, I think this is good enough. Sorry about the shaking and the moving and yeah. So this is the little image I print to put on a shirt for my little kiddo and that's what it reads in a nutshell. So I'm going to go ahead calm him down somewhat and then press this image onto a shirt for him and yes i am happy that my cricket explore ear 2 is finally here so i can get going and so on and so forth all right guys so let me do a quick lint roll and just position this here so this is the reading and I'm going to place it down like right in the middle here but first let me go ahead and take some moisture out and today I'm using J and J packaging vinyl and it's um 275 degrees Fahrenheit for 15 seconds medium pressure cold peel. Alright. So I really didn't want to whip out the big heat press for this the 360 swing away so I'm trying to make this work and I don't want to have to fold this either Don't go any further, Kaden. I know you all too well. Well, you're just going to have to sit right there. So, my Teflon sheet is in the middle of the big heat press. So, don't go any further. This child of mine doesn't listen at all. I'm going to flip it over this side and I'm going to repeat the same. When I'm through, I'm actually on the kitchen counter. Okay then. Okay then. is the shirt it says cold peel so I won't even try to move the backing before it cools down why are you doing this to me huh? 
Why? Here you go. Go and look for Dada. Look if you see Dada coming. Go and fall Dada by the grill. You see Dada coming? You see Dada coming? Alright guys, for this um guys and this aspect of the video I have to do a voice over because there was a, a, a vehicle park at my gate blasting some music and you know I'm not gonna get copyrighted for that so I just had to cut that segment out and go right into doing a voice over because if I speed up the video y'all would miss a lot so here goes I think I just want to do something like this real quick Yeah. Oh my! This feel like it just blend in with the material. Oh my word! Yo, J and J packaging come through. I see people put some really shitty comments on this on Amazon, and I'm like, what is so hard? You are all English speaking people. What is so hard in reading and understanding? So that's a wrap, guys. That's it for today's video. Unboxing, calibration, and uh, my first cut on the Cricut Explore Air 2 Daybreak. Thank you so much for rocking with me. I'm out.